upsell and cross-sell products. What it means is, is, let's say the customer is looking at this product and we need to suggest another product, okay? So that's upsell. If you just go down a little bit, you can see that it's giving this customer a suggestion that if you buy this, you can also buy this, okay? And once the customer decide and they can go to add cart and they wanna go through the process, you will still have another option to even sell them another product, okay? So when you go here, you can just click here, view the, uh, the cart and here, you can say you might also be interested. So this is called cross sell. Okay. So the customer can buy this, but if you really, if you do this, you might divert the attention from this button, which is where you make your money when the customer goes through the process of checking out. So you really need to uh, be careful about what you put here. So let's just cancel that. I'll show you how to create it. It's, it's very simple. Actually, it's not uh, something that is really hard to do. So let's go to the actual store, go to the products and you are looking at here uh, a website that I already made. That's why I want to use different products to uh, upsell and cross sell. So I just want to use it as an example. But if we go to this product and open the product, because we need to edit it, what we can do is we can go all the way down without doing anything else and go to linked product and you will have that options. So if you go on top of here, it will tell you exactly what it is. And here as well, it will tell you exactly what this option is. So let's choose the upsell. So the upsell, we will give them suggestion of the scarf. Yeah. So once I write down the scarf, I mean, you might not have this, this product in your system yet because we haven't created a lot of products but it's the same same meaning so you'll just select that and we can update it or what we can do is while we're here because we've seen the result we can cross sell so we can cross sell ray-ban here yeah? uh, glasses that we have so glass we have is that one and we'll go up and update it if you go back to the store and actually let's just view the product you will have the same setting so you can see that it have that if i if i take that out i'll just show it to you that it will not come out if i remove it from here if i remove it from here this scarf here yeah? go up and update go back refresh this page this will be removed yeah this scarf this suggestion that we were given will be removed so let's just wait for the website to come up Okay, so you look at it, it's, it's been removed. Let's go back and add it. Okay, linked product scarf, yeah. Or let's just add another product. Let me choose, okay, anything else. Okay, so we'll just say uh, Samsung uh, Galaxy 9, okay? Okay, so let's just choose the product, Samsung. Anything about Samsung will come up and we'll just choose that. I will click update. Go back to the actual page, refresh it, and the phone should appear there. Let's just wait for it. You see, the phone is also here. So we can just give that suggestion. So you can put here unlimited products. It doesn't have to be one product. You can put other products as well. So let's say a scarf. We can say a man, man suit, and it will come up. Whatever we have, man t-shirt, and what else we have, man. We can give them a lot of suggestions, okay? So um, let's say, okay, that one and update it. Let's go back and refresh it. So it will make a lot of sense when this is populated. This is related product. This is the product that they are in the same uh, category. So if they are in a general category, which is, let's say, this category is men's category. So it will take random four items from men but this is where you suggested so this is like custom tailor made for exactly this product yeah that's how you uh, create upsell and cross sell so if you just go one more time to the cart let's just add and check our cross sell okay click view and as you can see it's working as well that's all about it Thanks for watching.